Hey YouTube, iPhone for Idiots here, and AppSense 2.0 is out. Yes, you can now jailbreak your iPad 3, your iPhone 4S, iPhone 4, everything pretty much iPod 4, except the uh, newest Apple TV. Um, it's an untethered jailbreak, and it's on 5.1.1. You can see um, this is my iPhone 4, which I just... Uh, updated to 5.1.1 as you can see that's why my uh, home screen looks a little goofy right now because I lost Cydia but we're gonna go ahead and add it back here in just a second so the jailbreak is very simple put my iPhone down and all you have to do is uh, download absence um, which you can see right there and you do that uh, from there's a link in the video <clears throat> and now this will work for uh, Mac or PC which is also very nice and the jailbreak is pretty fast um, I haven't even opened it yet, so let it open. Then it's going to recognize. Connect. Go ahead and connect your uh, your iDevice. Whoop! Sorry. And then you can run it. And there it is. You can see I plugged in my device and it recognized it and then all you gotta do is click jailbreak and away it goes um, so while it's jailbreaking this is only gonna take about two minutes um, you can see that my device isn't even on it will come on in a minute and I'll show you what it's doing but basically you just wanna watch the blue bar and give it its give it two minutes and uh, you should be done and have city it's that easy um, again you can do this Mac or PC this works for every device on 5.1.1 uh, one thing I guess I will notice, you'll, you'll notice I just updated to 5.1.1 and I'm doing the jailbreak. Uh, I do recommend it if at all possible. It's always best to do a clean restore to 5.1.1, but uh, I'm off to the lake and in a rush, so we're just doing it this uh, quicker way. And you can see, um, like I said, I don't know, it always seems longer when you're sitting here filming, but it should only take about two minutes. Again, <clears throat> for my iPhone 4 at least, I'll do my iPad 2 here shortly, but uh, this is kind of a sad day. It's uh, coming to the end of the life of this phone. Um, amazingly, I'll still be able to sell it on eBay for $250, $300, or something pretty nice like that. Again, see the phone going here. <clears throat> Finally, it looked to be about done, I believe. Bless you over there. And again, you can see I would, again would wait before I slide to unlock for the blue bar to be done and the complete process to have run its course. So the first, uh, <clears throat> and there we have it, finally. So I'm going to take it, unplug it, go ahead and slide to unlock, and we should see City, uh, uh where is City? I wasn't paying close attention. Ah, down here, in a folder all by itself. Insidia, so we'll go ahead and launch it, and hopefully the uh, it'll focus a little better. Sorry, this camera is nice, but the autofocus takes a long time to kick in. It's probably its biggest problem. Probably best maybe to wait until Memorial uh, Memorial Day and go ahead and do this. Probably go much faster. Okay, so again, this turn it on. Shh. So again, there you go. City was in this folder down here. Shh. And there you go. So that's it.